Understanding, don't dwell on it. A guide to moving forward. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we dive deep into the English language and unravel its mysteries one phrase at a time. Today, we're going to explore a very common and powerful phrase, don't dwell on it. Understanding this phrase not only helps in improving your language skills but also offers a new perspective on handling challenges. So, let's get started and find out what it truly means to not dwell on something. Don't dwell on it, is a piece of advice that you might hear when you're upset or worried about something that has happened. To dwell on something means to think, speak, or write at length about a particular subject, especially one that is bothering you or causing you distress. When someone tells you not to dwell on it, they're essentially advising you to not spend too much time thinking about the upsetting or negative event. The idea behind this advice is to encourage you to move forward and focus on the present or future, rather than being stuck in the past. Dwelling on negative events or emotions can be harmful to our mental health and well-being. It can lead to increased stress, anxiety, and even depression. Focusing on the negative can also prevent us from seeing the positive aspects of our lives and may hinder our ability to make constructive decisions. By learning not to dwell on things, we open ourselves up to greater resilience, the ability to bounce back from setbacks, and the capacity to find joy and satisfaction in our lives despite challenges. Stopping the cycle of dwelling on negative thoughts isn't always easy, but it's certainly possible with some practice and patience. Here are a few strategies. Practice mindfulness, be in the moment rather than getting lost in regrets about the past or worries about the future. Redirect your thoughts. When you catch yourself dwelling on a negative thought, consciously shift your focus to something positive or neutral. Talk about it. Sometimes, Discussing your worries with someone else can help you gain a new perspective and move on. Engage in activities. Doing something you enjoy can distract you from negative thoughts and improve your mood. Remember, it's natural to reflect on things that happen in our lives, but it's crucial to do so in a healthy manner. Don't dwell on it, is more than just a phrase, it's a reminder that our focus and energy are better spent on the present and future, not on what can't be changed. We hope this video has been informative and helps you navigate your thoughts more positively. If you found this helpful, please like, share, and subscribe for more insights into the English language. Keep moving forward, and don't let the past hold you back. See you in the next video.